All right, ladies and gentlemen. So in this video, we're gonna upload a design together. We're gonna fill out their title, description, um, bullet points, get those keywords going, get some of the resources and some of the websites I use um, to, you know, from coming up with the idea all the way to getting some keywords. All right, so we're gonna design something together, put it up on merch, and I'm basically gonna show you how my workflow flow goes, um, some of the tools and websites I use, and let's get this started. So let's look for dogs. Obviously, this is a very competitive niche. When I come in here, you see I'm at Amazon, kinda will roughly give me the best selling um, dog t-shirts. Now, sometimes what I do is I use this little Chrome extension. It's you can uh, unicorn smasher. As towards what is interesting for me and us would be the rank. So I press here. I think it still has to be uploading. All right, so we have it loaded. Uh, we're gonna try to um, organize the rank here. So just click on the rank, and then uh, the it'll kind of show us the ranking on using the word keyword dog, right? Kind of get an idea of what's selling pretty well. So let's just click through a few of them. All right, so we're gonna have a look at this. Um, so we have this design, as you can see, it's best dog mom ever. Um, it has a kind of like a grainy, distressed look. So when you're coming up with some designs, definitely try to include this effect in them. Um, do something clean and then do something that has this look, distressed look. <clears throat> Let's look at the title. Um, the brand name is Best Dog Cat T-Shirts. Um, the title of the product is Best Dog Mom Ever Funny T-Shirt Gift. Um, so, you know, keep those words in mind, right? T-shirt, uh, funny T-shirt gift. Now in their bullet points, uh, they have, let's see, best t-shirt gift for mom, mother, dog lovers, and birth, uh, birthday, Mother's Day. Um, you know, a lot of people are going to be looking for t-shirts for their mother. So, you know, keep these uh, uh, keywords in mind, and we're going to be using this, this to upload our design. So we're going to basically going to do a dog t-shirt design. You have this other one. It says, it was me. I let the dogs out. It's in what rank? This one's selling pretty well. 431 in women. And it's priced at $14.99. Funny dogs out shirts. So we have a shirt. Um, hilarious, if it's hilarious, t-shirt. And it just has the title, you know, the tech, what's on the t-shirt. As you can see, a lot of keywords. Um, this is something you know kind of kind of strive for it makes sense it tells you where you can use it for what uh, ideally for who it is it's a great for a gift so high ranking t-shirt and it seems like the bulletin ports are on point um the brand title is pretty good a funny dogs out uh, shirt so if you know this kind of all helps out i believe all right, so I hope you saw that uh, the most of the best-selling designs are fairly, fairly simple and nothing too crazy, right? So for keywords, just go to Merch Research, go to the keyword tools, and you have a few of them there you can try out and see if you like. Some of them are free, some of them you have to pay. Um, this is another one that's pretty cool. You're gonna be searching on Google. <clears throat> so if you make a pretty much a unique um, title, description and stuff, 
you can end up in um, Google pretty quickly with your Amazon listing, your merch by Amazon listing. So by the way, this is keyword tool dominating for .com. Now, if you want to go more crazy into merch and with mo more crazy into finding keywords, definitely check out Merch Informer. Merch Informer's blog has a great post about keywords. So if you need a lot more information about this, definitely go check that site out. Um, so you can get keywords from here as well. Let's see, we're doing a plug mom. So from here, you know, you can go um, dog t-shirts and then they'll give you what's popular, like uh, lab dogs. And then I decided to uh, pick pugs because they're also really popular. And we'll see what results we get. So Pug Mom, Pug Mom T, so make sure we have that. Now what's cool about this, it can give you details if these keywords are, you know, searching, people are searching a lot and how is the competition. Uh, so competition score is A, uh, which is good. So this is a keyword definitely to use. So let's get that. And as you, oh. And as you can see as well, you have a lot of keywords right here. You could kind of analyze and go crazy into it. And, you know, try to make your listening make sense though, right? Don't just put keywords in there. So I'm no keyword expert, um, definitely have a lot to learn to optimizing my own listings. Um, so, but I would love to hear how you guys are doing, if there's a tool or resource that, you know, is benefiting you. If you've seen something in my listing that I was doing wrong, would love to hear it as well. Also, you know, if you have a, you know, another topic you'd like to see me do a video of, uh, just hit me up below and I'll link all the resources down there as well. Um, all right. Until next time, peace.